Hey everyone, welcome back to another EVA tutorial, today I am gonna show you how to create, a parametric door swing, that opens or closes on your input, so no further ado let's get started. For this tutorial, I'm using the door we have created before, that is modern styled door, I have added a card and left the link in description. Open, Revit. Let's open the default door family. Go to reference level, select the swing and edit the family. Now go to reference level. Close the unnecessary tabs, go to door family we have created before and go to reference level. Now go back to swing family and load it in door family and place it as shown. Align the swing family very carefully to reference planes as shown. Let's assign parameters to the swing, select the swing family and go to edit type. For thickness select panel thickness parameter. For width assign a new parameter, I'm going to name it panel width. Now go to family types, for panel width, write the formula as shown. There is some problem we have left behind in this family, handle is not perfectly attached to the panel, let's fix this, select the handle, go to edit type, for thickness assign a new parameter naming handle thickness. Now go to family types, for handle thickness, write the formula as shown. All the formulas have been given in the description. Now let's verify the swing is working fine or not. As you can see swing is now parametric, let's set the visibility parameters. Select the handle, under graphics click visibility or graphics, we don't want to see this handle in plan and when it cuts in plan, to do so let's untick it. Even we don't want to see this handle in coarse or medium detail level. In plan we don't want to see this panel as well, so let's do the same as we have done for handle. Leave the detail levels as it is as we want to see this panel in elevations and sections in every detail level. Let's check our family in project. Open a new project.
replace some of the walls. Load the family in project and place it as you need. As you can see there is some problem, let's fix it. Go to family and select the panel highlighter and change the visibility or graphics options as we have done before. Now let's load it back in project and overwrite the parameters. Now it looks fine, but still we need swing angle to be flexible. Let's do it. Go to the door family and select the swing family, under graphics you can find the swing angle, let's assign parameter to it. I'm going to name it same. We want the swing angle to control separately for each door let's change it to instance parameter. Now load it back in project. As you can see now we have control over door swing.